Well, we work together with Volvo to, uh, to create a, an experience of Spotify in the car, which is actually embedded in the dashboard, which is a world first. So Spotify actually lives in your dashboard. It's a beautiful uh, integration where you can actually use a touchscreen to, to access all the music in the world, or you can use the, the, the buttons on your steering wheel or any of the buttons that are in your center console. And you can actually also use your voice. So you can just speak to the radio and say, I want to listen to the boss, and it'll know the boss is Bruce Springsteen and start playing Bruce Springsteen for you. So it's really hands-off access to 20 million tracks, our full catalog, completely hands-off with your eyes on the road and your hands on the steering wheel, which is exactly what we want to achieve. We see a total integrated feature, Spotify in this case, which is embedded in the car and which by that gives full functionality to the driver from the car. So you don't need to bring any sort of device, you have it available in the car. Approximately 70% of all Americans and Europeans listen to music in the car. So it's a really important place for us as a streaming music service to be. We know that if people would start picking up their phone to access our database while they're driving, we've actually lost a bet. So we need to make sure that the, the user interface in the dashboard is as good as the one that we have on other devices. What we would like to secure in the future is that all features, all sort of connectivity and infotainment people have at their home should be available in the car. So it goes for music, TV programs, traffic information, all these sort of features is, is available and Spotify is, uh, is for us a major step. These are just the first steps and we have, of course we are picking the the, the right partners that share our vision of a great music experience in the car, but we're only just getting started.